Hey Wally, I'm just uh, looking over some of these uh, areas that Thomas has done a census for. And so far, uh, you can see I kind of blanked out all the ones that are not dams, in my opinion, um, and from my experience. So he's got a lot of dams that are not. I haven't I haven't done all of these yet. That's why you see so many that are still okay. But um, I'm about this far in this second group from the bottom, and I did a little bit at the top. But as you can see here, we've got one dam here. He didn't mark it, but there's another dam right here. There's a dam right here that I would quantify. Um, there's probably a dam right here too because of the dead veg and a little bit of water, but you can't distinctly see the... Uh, uh, dam, and so I wouldn't count that one. I would just count this one, this one, and possibly, but not this one because I can't see the, I can't see the dam here. Uh, but you can see this is definitely a dam that he didn't mark. So there's definitely some room for improvement. I'm gonna continue to go through and start and stop this video as we go along. All right, Wally, this is another example for you. He's got this one marked right here there's a dam right here um so just downstream of it continuing on all right well this is a uh an example of one that he misclassified you can see he he classified all three of these as active dams they're way too geometric um way too straight my guess is that they're man-made structures and not dams uh beaver dams so, again, another situation where he had these labeled as um, beaver dams, and they're, they're not, in my opinion. They're way too straight. This is the last one that I'll show of this, but yeah, just another example. They must have tried to do some type of restoration or something here, or they're manipulating human anthropogenic manipulation right here. Those don't look like beaver dams to me. They're way too, way too straight. All right, this is one of his examples. This is in uh, another watershed um, within the John Day. And you can see that he's accurately labeled these beaver dams. Um, however, there's a lot more in here. There's one right here, one right there. Um, one right there, one right there, one right there. So we've got and one right there, one right there. So he's definitely got, this is, that's a possible one, um, just from looking at it real briefly. Um, so there's, there's one right there, there's one right there, there's one right there, there's one right there. So he's definitely missed a lot in these areas um, and and definitely I'm not dogging what he did you know he's learning and stuff like that but there is definitely some potential for um, some further classifications in these areas and my bet is that I haven't looked at the uh, the brat output but looking at this vegetation and it being riparian so much through here my guess is that it would have a pretty high um, dam density in there. Here's an example of he classified a active dam here. Looks like a blown out dam to me. So you've got all these, all this beaver up here, um, and it looks like a a blowout right along this side that ate away this river bend. So that is up to you whether whether you want that to be, still be classified or not in this uh, data set. All right, Wally, here's one that he missed, um, right, that was missed right here. Um, I put a deep beaver dam point right there. Uh, just for this video, I'm not putting one in there quite yet. Um, but just to let you know. All right, Wally, just to end the video with final thoughts and whatnot, I'm gonna just uh, take that down. Okay, so, Total number of dams out of that 290 um, that I would
would classify as a dam is about 139. So it is chopped in half, um, that number. And you can see here, I haven't deleted any of them, but I'll make a new shape file or a KML file that just includes the dams that I've truthed um, for this. Uh, I would suggest using that one instead of this uh, Beaver Dam Census, um, just with the initial learning curve of, of Thomas, I would suggest this, um, you know, with these edits that it's pretty solid with um, those beaver dams. Hold on. Um, 